Live from Lala Rink in North Andover, Massachusetts, it's Merrimack College men's hockey action as the Merrimack Warriors get set to take on the Brown Bears from the ECAC. Now it comes back to Jordan Seifert, Quisenberry, back the other way for Brown on a two-on-two, -two, a quick shot. Hugo Olas makes the save. Brown grabbing the loose puck. This is Bradley Coca along the half wall. Coca in front shot, score! Brown, 33 seconds into the game, gets on the board. Good perimeter work, and they got the puck to the near circle. It was banged home. Puck deep in the Merrimack zone. Warriors continue to press for the equalizer with two minutes remaining. Here in this opening period, here's a quick shot over the top of the net. Bradley Coca firing that one. And a quick shot from the far circle, and it deflects in. And Brown has built a two-goal lead here in the opening period. 18.09 will be the time. The goal scorer, Brett Bliss. Quick shot is wide of the goal. Picking the corner there was Thomas Manti. And now quickly a centering pass goes back to the point here. Shot, score! From just inside the point. It was rifled, and the goal will come from Lyndon Granberg at the 325 mark. Matt Capone, the Mansfield native, swings it up ice for the Warriors. Capone, cross ice pass. Here's a quick shot, score! Philip Forsmark puts Merrimack on the board. Capone will pick up the assist. A badly needed goal. It comes at 415, three to one Brown. Captain from Ridgefield, Connecticut on this Brown squad. Very, very good player, and he made a real nice play with the stick there. Hillier tries to drop one. Brown with a chance here. Plessy into the zone. Plessy trying to get room, and he scores! It's a short-handed goal for Nathan Plessy as he just tucked that between the pads of Hugo Olas. They've now given up 13 goals in the last three games. They gave up six to Providence last Saturday. And the Bears come back in the offensive zone. Saucer pass in front, tipped in. It's a goal for Cole Quisenberry. Received a contact to the head penalty and subsequently a game misconduct. Here come the Warriors. Felton, the three Brown players right there with him. Felton flips it toward the net. Caron out of position, loose puck, score! Short-handed goal for Alex Jeffries. And Merrimack lights the lamp 39 seconds in. So a bright spot here for Merrimack as they make it a 6-2 game. Very impressive win for Brown here in North Andover tonight. As the Bears scored within the first 33 seconds and never looked back. And the clock will expire. And the Brown Bears come into Lala Rink. They'll pick up their fifth win overall. Brown will go to 5-10-2. And, and Merrimack will dip to 14-6-1.